Hello everybody, my name is Austin Artesius, and welcome to another episode of Austin Artesius. We like Austin Artesius. I'm Austin Artesius. Let's play the worst level of this game. It's been a long time since I last recorded. What have I done? Um, learned how to solve a 4x4 cube. That's pretty cool. It's like it's like a 3x3, three three, except you know, like two more algorithms. Comes another. Uh, that's a spooky little bit of a spook. spook st uh, uh, spookiness. Yoink! I said yoink. Thank you for yoinking. Hey! You're dead now. <sighs> this game is wonderful, and I absolutely love everything about it, except for this level. Whee! Ah, God. Platforming. Uh. Ah, that's a quick load. Another. Hey look! Yo, someone else has tried. That's a spooky little scary boy bit of this game. HA! Stealth kill! HA! Stealth kill! Dishonored up in here. Dishonored is overrated, okay? I'm gonna say that right now. You know what? I'm saying what we all are thinking, and what we're all thinking is that Dishonored is overrated. It's a mediocre stealth game. With mediocre action. Oh, well, okay, no, the action's pretty good. But, like, it actively discourages you from choosing action. Like, oh, you have action? Ha! Now all of the levels are 98% harder. All the time. Screw you for taking the path that this game was obviously designed for. We... We don't want you choosing that. It's just, uh... If you're gonna make a stealth game, commit to it. Don't make a bunch of stealth mechanics and actively discourage action and be like, eh, let's put a lot of effort into the action. Let's uh let's actually make this more of an action game. Let's let's not focus on the stealth. Let's just make this an action game. And you know what? That ain't good. Ha! Nope! Okay. Oh god, these things. This is the worst enemy in the uh. This is the worst enemy in the game right here. Because you look at it and like you shoot it and you're like, okay, obviously I can't kill that. Oh no, you can. Yep, it takes quite a few shots, but you can. No explanation. No explanation at all. I love this game. I love this game. I really do. I think it's wonder fantastic. And wonderful. Also, they're super way too tanky. And they, they just give you no feedback. Ah, you can turn that off. Uh, in case, I don't know, you want to use a flashlight more. Oh, okay. Poor boys, thank, thank you. Reeking! This game's really good at making, um... Hit scan combat good. A lot of the, a lot of the, uh, uh, a lot of the complaints with modern combat systems is that it's all hit scan, or at least a lot of the complaints from the areas of YouTube that I go on. Which is, uh, as you are probably aware, thirty-year-old uh, nostalgic. PC gamers who think the industry died in 2007. And frankly, quite depressing. We go up there. I don't remember much of this part. I think uh, my mind blocked it out. Ah, yes, this is where we go. This is an okay part. You just gotta press these. Um. Oh, no, you don't. Hey, what do you do here? Oh, do you have to do them in a certain order? No. Yeah, uh... No. Okay, no, they're all... Ah, that's right. These boys got fly to them. Come fly with me! Come fly! Let's fly away! 
they come fly with you, they come fly, they come fly away, and there we are, one, three, three, two, uh, uh, numbers. I can count. I wonder what's behind it. Spoiler! More horrible level design! Uh, don't arc square, excuse me. That freaking... Oh, okay, never mind. Sorry, on OBS, the stop recording button is highlighted, and that's kind of irritating me, because it makes me feel like if I press enter, I can stop recording. <laughs> that's a sound effect. Hey! What are you doing? Ye yeet. Yas. <laughs> wow. I d I've never noticed that sound effect before. Sounds like they got a a woman from around the office who was in her mid thirties to uh, imitate that sort of thing. Hey. Hey. Ah! Right? Can you hear that? Carol Johnson from uh from the next cubicle over to you. The one who has four cats. Uh, you brought her into your, uh, into the recording studio one day and be like, Hey, you know what? Why don't you, um... Okay, that's, that's all that's gonna happen. Oh, there's also way too little ammo here. And also, these freaking little, little pieces of crap that are way too good at being themselves. It's freaking, where are you? They're awful. These enemies. Are they, oh my god, they're tiny gonarchs. They have tiny little uh, sacks there. Oh, that's cute. If, no, that was cute. It would be cute if that was cute. Um, they would be cute if they were cute. Oh yeah. I swear to god, I heard something. <sighs> well, this boy carries some rockets around with him. All right. Ah. All right. Go Nark. All right. Well, let's go. Let's go. Oh yeah, let's go. Let's actually go. Ah, my map! Oh, that's right. Yeah, this thing, you just fall through it. Luckily, there's healing pools. Come on, let me just... I... Okay, I feel like that wasn't the best use of resources. Um, is that... Yeah, that's all. He's there. God dang it. That's the thing, that's the um... Freaking hate everything. Except for this game, I love this game. But this game... Oh, this game is... It's not easy to love this game. Nope. That's death. Let's uh, let's sit in here for five freaking minutes. How you doing? Talk about a 4x4 Rubik's Cube. 4x4 is pretty cool because it's just exactly the same as 3x3, three three, except you need to know like two pretty easy algorithms and like six really hard ones that I have to look up every time. Um, that's pretty cool. It took me about freaking. Uh, a couple of years to learn how to solve a 3x3. Three three. It was on and off, admittedly. But, um... It did take, did take quite a while. Um, very difficult puzzle. Mostly, um... Much to plenty of people's surprise. Uh, memorization. Well, to my surprise, memorization. Um... Yeah, really fun puzzles. Uh, you can tell why it's the greatest selling toy ever made. <laughs> 
Uh, I'm not sponsored, but I wish I was. Oh boy. Um, ah, we're all... What? Those, those things respawn? Excuse me? I should not be using the, um... This boy's ammo. Ah! Ah, uh, wait! Yes! Come on! I should get some LaCroix. And so should you! Wait, no. I wanna... Oh, God. Oh, man, I have to sit in that pool for another, like, half a second. God dang it to heck! Gosh darn son of a gun. I will. Come on! Oh god. Nah, this boss fight's okay. It's one of the... This game has like two boss fights that are like right next to each other. This one and the other one in Zen. That's kind of weird. That's not I, not what I would have chosen. Okay, let's go. Um, of course, you saw the other ones. The, um... Tentacly Boy. Mr. Cool. Of the Tenta variety. Tentacleman? Joseph Tentacleman. Alright, well... It's okay, we didn't do that anyway. HA! I have the high ground, it's over now. I have the high ground, Anakin. Or whatever that sound is. Sound? Line. Technically, it is a sound. So, I'm... Look, listen. Oh, yeah. This is what I like to see. Oh, yeah. Mm. Top tier, top pumps. Not in terms of their... The 45th president of the United States of America. Like the, the old British game. Maybe it's not old. Maybe it's still being made. I don't know. I think found out about it from an Ashen. Let me say that again. Found out about it from an Ashen. Oh, okay. This is my life now. I, you cannot hit these things. They're just impossible. Freaking impossible. And they gang up on you in swarms. Swarm up on you in gangs. I swear. Oh, hey. Ha! Eat this! Tentacle, uh... Gonark scum. And that's all that. Oh, wow, what perfect timing. Ha! Idiot. Uh, let's go down here. Into the teleporter. I believe that's a teleporter. Anyway, yeah, it's a teleporter. <sighs> that's that chapter done. In 13 minutes. Okay, that's um. This thing just like shoots you super far into the air and. You land on one of these boys. <sighs> ah, alien controllers. These guys. These boys. Okay. You ah. Life pro tip. If you have a stutter, don't say the word ghost because people might think there's one behind them. Um. Yes! Ah! Ah! God! God, do I hate this level. That's it's, it's freaking. I'm not even gonna try to not save scum, because this is just. We're danky like. Oh, God. My ideal. Okay, I wanna describe to you my ideal video game, because I seriously have nothing else to do. Because this is just tedious. Like, some of the earlier levels in this game are just brilliant, and that's why it's one of my favorite games of all time. But, like, this part, this part right here, 
This really gets my goat. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh man, oh jeez, oh Josh, oh Josh, oh gosh, oh man, oh god. Yep. Once you get into there, there's no redemption. You just have to resign to the fact that you're never gonna live again. Which I mean, uh, 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 yeah, stutter, stutter, stutter. That's purely, this game runs like crispy, crispy butter. Um, actually, let me check freaking the, I do kind of FPS am I getting? Exactly 100, wow. Oh, okay, oh. Uh, hey, uh, hey, Bob. Hey, uh, well, you put that in the level there. Hey, Bobby. Why not? Uh, freaking, that was a bad bit. If I've ever made one. And I have, because that's one of them. And also because I have made all of this stuff that you see before you. Not all this stuff that you see before you. If you clicked on... Jesus Christ! That freaking thing... No swearing in my Christian server. Uh, that, that freaking little god dang son of a heck is just the worst thing in the history of level design. It's just like complete and total contempt for your audience. Hey, huh. Might as well just put a little uh, canyon there, eh, Bob? And uh, make it a little bit uh, harder on them. Oh, yeah, that sounds like a perfectly uh, fine idea you got there, Bob. Oh, yeah, I, I'm sure that won't be frustrating to the, uh, the masses at all. Freaking son of a heck. I hate you. I hate this level. And I hate... I love this game. God, I love this game. This game is so hard to love, though, once you're playing the last chapter. The last level. Last few chapters. Zang. Disappointing final level syndrome. This is the poster child for bad last levels. Alright, let's jump up. Yeah, 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 shut up. Oh my god! Are you kidding me? This game is great. 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 Throw me up into the air like I just don't care, and I'm freaking dead. I hate living, except I don't because it's actually pretty cool. Wait, it's literally right behind you. That is even more horrible, sadistic level design. That I have ever seen. Oh, that's what you're supposed to do. Oh. You're supposed to go up on these boys. Let's go down here. Let's see what's going on down here. Is that silence? Does that mean there's no enemies in this bit? My god. I thought Zen was, uh, oh, thank goodness, was, uh, Gaben's excuse to, um, fit as many infuriating enemies. Oh, no, never mind. I was gonna go on a bit about how, oh, Gaben and stuff, but, ah, uh, that's, that's just proved me wrong right off the bat. Thank you very much. Refrigerate it. Refrigerate it. I love that little, I love the sound effects of these boys. These guys. I need to stop calling everything a boy, but it's so good. It's such a great word, boy. Cause like... Oh hey, that's what it was. That's what that noise was. Freaking Gabe, Gaben Newell. Gabe the Newell. The Gaben. And all of his Glory, glory. Whatever. Wee! I don't know if Gabe Newell actually designed any Valve games. I mean, obviously. Uh, other than Half Life. Because, like, Half Life. Well, I mean, obviously, it was 
Otherwise, he wouldn't have, you know, wouldn't have happened. Maybe he coded it. Maybe it wasn't designed to code. But still, he worked on this, but... Did he work at all in Half-Life 2? I don't think so, because I listened to the fan commentary of it, and I'm like, like, oh, hey, uh, I'll make, make the perfect game using this whole crap heck ton of resources that we have. Norwegia. Up! Thank you. Okay, that's some... Up, Steed! Okay, do you think we can uh, make this jump? Oh god, I don't think I can make this jump. Let's go, let's go, let's... <gasps> let's go! No. Let's know. Hey, let's know. You can't ever you 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 can you can never have too much knowledge. Let's know. Let's seriously take off nine health points. Health, as it's more commonly known, to people who aren't insane. Like I am. I'm working on a fun fact that is absolutely unrelated, but that's a neat little tangent of topic of tangent of topic. Um, a hot topic. Playing 21 pilot shirts. Um, dang! It's, it's freaking um, 11 health. 11 health P. H health. Thank you, thank you, thank you, no thank you, no thank you. Okay, let's go. Okay. Ah! Uh, we just need to hold out. Okay. 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 We just need to. Just need to stay alive until about now. Freaking son of a gun and all of his men. Could not put him back together again. God, hecking darn it! Gosh, heck darn! Just dodge, dodge, dodge everywhere, dodge everything. Remember uh, Zootopia? Everyone loved it for like eight weeks. Kind of like Pokemon Go, except Zootopia is actually. Made by people who care about what they do. Oh, hey, okay. hold on. Yes? Okay. That was 10 HP. But. I think we can make it work. But. I think we can make it work. That racist? No, it isn't. It's prejudiced as heck, but, and stereotyping, but that's not racist, because we're both white. French people and I, most of them at least, I don't know. What's the race statistics of, statistics, uh, demographics of, um, France? Kind of concentrating, not very interesting commentary. Let's go! Freaking let's go! Oh my god! Ah! <sighs> anyway. I don't know what the demographics are of that. Oh, this is a neat little. This is like the only good part of this. Because it plays like one of those Flash games. Eyes maze. Reeking! Oh my gosh! Are you kidding me? Heck! Heck you! Heck you! Heck you! Nope! 
still think Half-Life 1 is better than Half-Life 2. Um, despite this, despite all the bad things that Half-Life has going for it, like the, um, all the gra- Okay, the graphics are gonna be a bit divisive. In my opinion, they are. Um, in my opinion, they're divisive. I like the graphics a lot more than the, uh, I think, a normal person would. That's because I just think that this era of graphic technology is really cute. Like, that sounds condescending. Um, and in a way it is. Okay. Here's what we do. We reload. Save. The guys are two trank bolts. Oh my god. Four trank bolts. That's what I said. I said he dies before Trank Bolts. We've always been at war with East Asia. Um. Alright. Let's. Go. Let's. Oh yeah, these boys. Oh, I forgot about these guys. Hey, what's up? In infinitely respawning enemies. Horrible design. That is bad, and you should feel bad for doing it. I don't know if these guys infinitely respawn. Really get great place to, like, test your aim. I love this weapon. Nice little, like, um, pseudo insta -jib. In fact, actually, by definition, it is not insta -jib Because it does not kill everything in one hit. But for most things, it's insta -jib. I'm a boy. Yo, Gargantua! Get over! Get your face over! Ah, you didn't think I was gonna say face. Uh. I was, yeah, I was about to say, get your butt over here! Except I didn't say butt. Ah, oh, this is just that's great. That's, well, that's. I mean, obviously. That's just, that's just a given that that would happen. Okay, okay, okay. Hot! Ah, uh, what do we do with this guy again? We make him destroy the thumpers, don't we? Or do we kill him? We make him destroy the thumpers, we'll kill him. We'll take that, thank you very much. Some of that. Ah, oh, this is the starting area. <gasps> oh my god! I love the world. I love the world. I love the whole world. I love the world. What do we do with this guy? Oh, do we go back to where he was? Hot! Hot, 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 hot! We got it! Hot, hot, hot! Oh, thank you so much. We already have all those we'll ever need. Oh my god, oh my god. I want a horror game. I, oh my god, I started like talking about my... like. Oh, I, a uh, good topic of discussion is what your uh, ideal video game would be. And I totally didn't talk about my ideal video game. It would be a survival horror game where you're faced up against one monster, uh, which is basically SCP-682. Um, he adapts to everything you try to do to him, so every tactic you use to slow him down only works once. So you shoot him in the legs, congratulations, he's grown bulletproof legs. Shoot him in the eyes. Wow, you've taken him out for quite some time. He's completely blind, except once he recovers from being blind, uh, he has bulletproof eyes. You try to get to higher ground to, um, to evade him. Cool, very clever, but now he has wings. You know, that sort of thing. Um, I think that'd be really fun. I It would require some insanely great game design to pull it off, because... Like, to paraphrase, yes, I don't know, some about, some, like, writer's tip 
page on the SCP Foundation. There's not a game idea so bad that it cannot be pulled off with an amazing designer. And I, I truly believe that to be true. Um, like, there's some absolutely horrible ideas for games that are really good, like Papers, Please! Papers, Please! Oh, you, uh, you do paperwork, and that's it. You judge... You look at paperwork and you go, okay, look, hey, well, uh, freaking, are, are you fit to come into this country? But it's amazing. It's what a wonderful experience. Not like wonderful in the traditional way of like, you know, fun, but whatever, fun is overrated. <laughs> fun is overrated. That's a... I'm gonna take some of... Take... Ah, oh, that's right. Oh, okay. It's instantly it's, it's coming. Thank you. Thank you. Great game design. First person platforming bit. Um... It's another horrible game idea. Which, um... Can only be pulled off by... Some amazing design! And... Sadly... Aw, oh, that was just me. And sadly, this is, um... This isn't it. Oh, what? This game is balanced in the player's favor. Which is a blatant lie. See, the joke is that I outright stated a blatant lie um, in order to uh, do a parody of Holy crap, I've been co recording for... Uh, 31 minutes. Ah, oh, it's the, uh, it's the, um, yeah. Uh, uh, the, oh, what's it called? It's the factory level. Oh boy, what's going on here? I don't know. Let's see you next time.